Hi, hello. This is Anup here. Today we are going to look into Configuration Manager 2403 updates and deprecated features, etc., etc. So don't skip the video. Let's check this out. So SCM 2403 is out now, and this is in console update, as you all know, and this is a baseline version of SSEM so that this version can be used to install a new server etc. So more details available in the description of the video do check that out. This is the first version of SSEM for the year 2024. The most exciting feature for me is the global search. Global search is available in SSEM console now that is very exciting for me and microsoft entra id rebranding has happened in sscm and you can see some automation for the troubleshooting scenarios for software updates in sscm 2403 version also microsoft is introducing folder support for scripts that is not a big deal for me from my perspective but it is very easy to organize if you have folders and then from this version onwards SCM is not going to support HTTP only communications so either you need eHttp or you need HTTPS using the PKI certificates etc if you want to know more details about that check out the URL in the description of the video also, Microsoft is blocking this upgrade if you are running server 2012. It is time to upgrade, do an in-place upgrade of server 2012 if you are running those types of operating systems. And another exciting feature probably if you are supporting ARM64 operating system deployments. There's a boot media support available for ARM64 operating system deployment and then enhancement in deploying software packages with dynamic variables is available so retry this step if computer unexpectedly restarts number of times to retry maximum number of times that is five cm 2403 upgrade will be blocked if you are running cloud management gateway version one that is a cl classic cloud service and there are other important news coming out with this update is that it is going to stop supporting system center update publisher i don't know how many of you know seup is cup so that is planned for end end of support from jan 2024 and there are other improvements such as bit local improvements automated diagnostic dashboard for software update issues that is another important troubleshooting scenario and in the console itself you would be able to see what are the basic issues with software update or patching deployments that is very useful thank you all for watching see you around take care bye bye